my name is Sarah Hartland Rowe. I'm a painter that lives in Halifax. Um, I was commissioned to make a series of seven paintings for the new Dartmouth Bridge Terminus. I was really happy to get the commission because, among other things, I'm a, a huge booster of public transit and I take the bus all the time. I'm here with my assistant Tito El Sadiq and we're working on one of the seven panels for the long retaining wall at the new bus terminal, the Dartmouth Bridge Terminal. We're going to install the work in mid mid-August, but this is the final bit of the production phase. And the idea was that this would be work that had something to do with the site, the Dartmouth Common, uh, the bridge, um, the people that pass through the terminus. My interest is always in people, and so I've used some of the structure of the architecture as a backdrop for the paintings, but my real interest, my own personal real interest, is in the people that are flowing through it, the, the things that they're doing, the things they're thinking about. And so my proposal for the piece at the Terminus had two strands to it. One was that these paintings would be descriptions of people as they pass through the Terminus or they ride on the bus. And you can be in lots of different states as you're traveling. You can be talking to someone, you can be writing a list, reading a book, checking your Facebook, you can, be, you can be actively doing things. But you can also be very passive. You can be asleep, you can be listening, you can be listening to music, you can be daydreaming, and you can be in a state where things just sort of pass in front of you without you really having to think about them. And so I wanted the paintings to do two things. I wanted them to be full of small incidents. So if you looked for it, if you were interested, you could find it. Um, but I also wanted them to be, in a word, I wanted them to be beautiful, so that if you were in a passive mode, if you were just letting things pass in front of you, what you would see when you looked at the paintings, what, all you would be aware of was just pattern and color, and it would be pleasing to you. And so, with Tito's help, I've worked with a palette and patterns that I find beautiful and interesting, and I hope that they, you know, find a resonance in other viewers as well.